It is the middle of November and I've been here about six weeks and made a little progress straightening up. Here we are in the loft, my office space, and I did manage to move furniture around. So this is now the little extra table. It's supported by a small bookcase on this end. Um, it's actually a very nice tile top and eventually I'll have it cleared off. I put some books in the bookcases here. Those are in their permanent location and the printer cart is here under the window leaving just enough space for the vent and there's my secretary desk and the drop down provides some added working area adjacent to the other desk with the computer on it and in the corner I have put a hanging lamp from the ceiling and the clock is up there and there's a little television the cable runs around from my bedroom into the loft here and the phone actually I ran a line all the way around the wall and past the bedroom door and it goes down over the railing into the kitchen and as we look here I've made a dent in these book boxes um, although it doesn't much look like that because I kind of consolidated some that were elsewhere um, as I emptied quite a few boxes and when I put them on the shelf here and the other bookcase I'm trying that in a couple of different positions I've put this over here now so as we walk up the stairs I suppose I should have walked up first so it creates a little foyer type area and if I decide to keep it here I think I'll have to wait till all of these boxes are aside and then this chair and its mate and a table we'll see how much space there is to walk through here and going into the bedroom um, that hasn't really changed too much well I got to turn the light on should have done this during the daytime it's no nice and bright then um, I did relocate the furniture so the dressers and television are now on the angled wall which makes for better viewing from bed and the dollhouse is stuffed over here behind these boxes and um, pretty much all these boxes are empties um, I don't know how many of them I'm going to save put them in the attic break them down or what have you but they're good boxes and if we take a look downstairs I've made a bit of a dent down here as well you can actually see the table I cleared away some of those drawers that were stacked on the table and put them in the closet in the bedroom and let's take a look at what else I've done ah pictures are on the wall look at this I think though this collage from my travels I think I might put that up in front of my desk so I'll have I can look up and look at that and while I'm working and reminisce about the places I've been so I still have to get brackets and the shelves in the closets and and let me turn this light on here in the living room so I got my little Halloween slash Thanksgiving display up here so in the bedroom here and it's very dark uh, I put these drawers and we'll see in the closet here that's the pair of them and there was a couple of boxes that were in here since before I even moved in the very first thing I brought over in my car so I opened those boxes and put them out I don't even remember what was in one of them the DVD was in one of them the other one I don't remember so 
I uh, have cleared away stuff on the kitchen counter. It's a good place to drop things when I come in. And uh, I also put the under cabinet light here. Mm, makes a nice bright light now. This chair, I still don't know quite what I'm going to do with it. Um, and these boxes are now empties. Um, but I might save one, perhaps. It's a good sturdy box. Um, but I was able to clear those boxes and put a lot of that stuff in this cabinet here that was in those boxes. Previous to that, I had food in those cabinets. The food, however, now has a new home. <coughs> I got some pantry shelves and put it inside the laundry closet door. So all of these packages were in that base cabinet. Now, not only did that make more room in the base cabinet, I also do not have to stoop, stoop down, bend down to get things out of the cabinet, which the right things are going. Bending is getting harder. So, I also discovered there's an under cabinet light under the microwave, so there's extra light over the stove as well. So things are coming along. And uh, I guess that's a bit of an update now. So take a look. So we go back upstairs. And there's where we started. That's Whitey. Hello, Whitey.